IronCAD now has the ability to create custom sheet metal forms. You can see we've created a part here that's going to represent the uh, shape of the form. We've given it some design variations for different sizes. You can see there, so we toggle through those. And we'll use that to create the uh, We'll use the forming tool and we'll use the, the stopping face here. We'll select stopping face. We'll go faces to remove that top face and that'll open it up in the form. And we're going to uh, select this part and just drop it into a catalog. So these will be drag and drop based. We can rename that. We'll uh, call that open just because it has the open face. And we'll go back and we'll edit the forming tool feature and we'll take out the faces to remove so that it will become a, a closed feature. And we'll drop that into the catalog and we'll rename that to closed. And we'll do one last uh, change. Go ahead and remove the blend and then we'll edit the option again. And we can put the radius right into the forming uh, advanced options and put an offset in there so it offsets from that geometry when it creates the form on the sheet metal part. So we'll uh, Put that in the catalog and rename it. And now we'll switch over to our sheet metal part and we can begin dropping these out onto the part. And you'll see it'll prompt us for the design variation that we want. And then it'll put the uh, form into the into the sheet metal. We can drag that out again. And this time choose a different design variation, hit apply and OK. And you see we get the different size. And we can then move that with the tri-ball if we wish. Put that anywhere we want. And this time we'll go ahead and uh, drop on the other side the closed uh, form. And again it has a design variation. Uh, you can see it's closed top this time. And again we can bring that out and choose a different design variation if we wish. And lastly, we'll bring out the offset, and you'll notice again design variation is available. And this time it'll create it, it actually offsets the geometry, so it makes a small, uh, you know, by 0.1 inch uh, uh, smaller uh, form there, and puts in the uh, fillets automatically based on the dimension we put in the feature.